the man of the hour. How's it going? I'm doing well. How are you? I am good. Okay. So we're going to talk about home team and all that stuff. So ironically, so I was home this past weekend and my sister and everyone was sitting on the couch and they were like, we should pick a movie to watch. It had been a long day. And my sister goes, why don't we watch the home team? <laughs> I was like, I was like, actually, you know what? We definitely should be watching that. I had already watched it because I knew about you in the interview coming up, but I was like, let's watch it again. So you were right up there on Netflix. <laughs> you made the right choice. You made the right choice. I love it. So, okay, where are you right now? Right now I'm in uh, Texas right now. Gotcha. So you're just like a normal kid day to day right now. Yes, normal, normal. Well, I'm homeschooled, so not, not normal, funny, but a little, kinda, a little yeah. normal. Yes. Have you yeah. watched the movie on Netflix itself? Like, have you like physically gone onto Netflix and clicked the movie? You know, yes, yes, I have. I've watched it twice now I think I watched it once when it was sent to me before it was released and I watched it once again just to kind of see myself up there on Netflix but <laughs> uh yeah I watched it twice yeah that's good what do you feel when you see you know you on Netflix you know it it used to I mean it's it's still a little weird I guess yeah. um I'm getting more used to it. And I kind of knew this was happening for a while and I was preparing myself for it, but it was still a little bit shocking to see myself up there. Yeah. And throwback to when you first, so you found out that you got the part. What was that like? I, okay. So I got a, I got a call from my managers when I got the part and it had been a pretty long audition process. So I was really waiting. I was super anxious and I, I wanted to, to play Connor so badly. And as soon as I got the call, I ran through my house. I was so excited. Oh my gosh. I was yelling like a wild kid. It was awesome. I was oh my God. So I feel the same way. Are you a big football fan in real life? Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh so yeah. It was even better. Yeah. It was so much better. As soon as I read the script, I was like, this is awesome. Yeah. It has everything I need. Football, Kevin James, comedy. It was just a no brainer, but Thanks. Yeah, I've been a big football fan for pretty much my whole life. Um, I'm a I'm a Broncos fan, but I'm also oh. a big Saints, oh. fan. I'm a Saints <laughs> fan after this. Yes. Yeah, for sure. Okay, so I was gonna say, who is your team? Do you like Denver Broncos? Denver Broncos. Yeah, most of my mom's family is from Denver, so we've got, got a whole side of the family that are Broncos fans. Yeah. How do you feel about Von Miller coming over to Rams and then winning a the Super Bowl? <laughs> I'm very happy for Vaughn, but it yeah. does hurt. It does hurt. <laughs> okay, so if you could, so say this movie is like your real, real life, who would you want to play on the same team with on the Saints, say their current team? Ooh. Or you could do an old team. Mm, that's that's tough. I I don't even know. I'd say, man, that's, that's hard. I'd say probably <laughs> Taysom Hill. He's so, yeah. like, he can play so many different positions. That's just incredible. He's a, like a Swiss army knife football yeah. player. It's, I don't even know how he knows how to play so many positions, but he's amazing at it. It'd be okay, so cool. does. <laughs> yes. Who's your favorite NFL player? Oh man. Okay. That is a hard one to say. Um, <laughs> I, man. You know, I'd have to say, uh, hmm, probably. Cortland Sutton on the Broncos he's the first receiver for them and uh I've been a big fan of him for a while so he's probably my favorite player followed up closely player. by Derrick Henry because I think he's a beast also a beast yeah for sure yes. do you do you play football in real life or um ever? I've always kind of wanted to play tackle but because of my acting I haven't really yeah. been able to if you get hurt I'm yeah, gonna, you're screwed. You're, you're so screwed. screwed. You can't do anything. Oh, so wow. I've I've played flag here and there, but no no full tackle. But I I know enough about football, and I've got a good football base, so I was able to kind of use that knowledge for home team. That was perfect. And you have a little brother, right? Yes, I do. I have a little brother. His name is Teddy. He's 11 now, and he's also an actor. I love it. And do you? What do you guys do for fun if you're not you know casting and acting in big movies? <laughs> You know, I think we do things that any kid does. We play video games together. We throw the football. We ride our bikes to the park. We, you know, we're, we're normal, normal brother normal stuff. Normal. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> normal for the most part, aside from that. Yeah. And what was it like acting with Kevin James? Oh, You're like, son of man. That had been such a dream. I'd been a huge fan of Kevin's for so long. And um, 
you know, obviously he's hilarious on the screen, but he also has such a great dramatic side that's very underrated and he doesn't get enough credit for that. But um, working with him was amazing. He's such a down to earth person yeah. and you, know, you don't always know what to expect when you work with bigger people like Kevin, because they could have a huge ego for all you know, but he yeah, was such a down to earth person. And it was a dream working with him. And it taught me a lot, really. Yeah. It's so cool when you hear from, cause like, obviously we'll do other interviews and people are like, no, they were actually really cool and down to earth. And it's like, cause you never know what type, like, cause he's like a legend. Like it's Kevin James kind of thing. It's like, exactly. what is it like, like talking yeah. to him, like when you're not yeah. recording, you know? So it's like cool to hear that people are normal and fun and stuff. Yes, so. exactly. You don't oh always, God. you don't always get nice celebrities. So <laughs> <laughs> I know. And it's like, Oh God. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> and do you have a part like, or apart from the home team, what, like, is there, do you want to get in the TV show? Would you want to do like a little euphoria action or is there like all American maybe? What would you, you know, want a, a show I, or a project to be a part of? You know, I think uh, I just take everything at face value and I read the script and if I really connect with it, that then I kind of know, I kind of play it by gut. So if I connect with the script, it has good people behind it. And um, overall, if I enjoy the script and it touches me in one way, that's, sort of a direction I'd like to lean in I don't think there's anything specifically that I'm thinking of but yeah. it, it, it all depends on uh the the script and if I connect with it yeah I totally feel that and what's one thing that you what's your, like your guilty pleasure like do you like with your just being a kid like do you like getting <laughs> ice cream do you like just like going out riding bike like what do you like yeah, I think your, it's like, yeah, the junk food the junk food is my <laughs> I, I, I gotta stay fit for my roles but You're right wow you know you you gotta have a slice of pizza but <laughs> so whether it's just junk food pizza or burgers yeah. or whatever it might be I yeah. Food yeah. is a guilty pleasure. <laughs> and what do your parents say about all this? Like you're their kids on Netflix. You know what I mean? Like you're, you're an actor at a young age kind of thing. Like you have talent. Thank you. Thank you. You know, well, my, my parents have, they've been supportive of me since the beginning. It, yeah. it was my idea to start acting and they fully supported that. They've always been really uh, supportive of my dreams and yeah. I've been, acting for five years now so we've kind of they've kind of been preparing themselves for something like this to come the way come my way so um yeah. I don't know that it was as big of a shock to them as it was to me to see myself yeah, but, uh, yeah. yeah we'd been kind of waiting for this for a little while so yeah yeah and now you got both boys in it so they're dealing with both kids <laughs> yes yes we got both boys in it the Blum boys <laughs> okay we're gonna play a fun little game it's gonna be this Perfect. or that all right okay. all right Mm hmm so candy or ice cream Oof. okay all right i'm gonna <laughs> have to say ice cream i'm gonna have to say ice cream if it's hard candy mm, i don't know i don't think they're mutually exclusive because there is candy ice cream too there's like there is it? or candy oh, and ice cream yeah exactly there's there's butterfingers ice cream there's snickers ice cream Reese's. i mean but yeah reese's both? ice cream there's both <laughs> I mean, <laughs> why choose one when you can have both? <laughs> <laughs> okay, fair, fair. Um, football or go karts? Oh my gosh! Okay. <laughs> Don't do that to me. All right, <laughs> go karts, go karts. I I love football, but racing go karts has been something I've I've always loved, and racing is something I've always loved. So I'd have to say that because you don't get to race as much as you get to play football. So yeah, that's my reasoning. Because you're a professional go kart racer, right? I, yeah, I was for a while. I think I, I've, I've taken a small, a small break in there because yeah. of my acting, but I'm planning to sort of go back into that here pretty soon. Yeah. You're an adrenaline kid. I feel like that's how you survive. Just all this adrenaline, like one of the part, getting the part, <laughs> yeah. acting. A little, I, guess, I guess you could say that. Yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh. Um, winter or summer? Oh, okay. You know what? Winter, winter. So um, I've lived in, I lived in California for most of my life. Yeah. But being out of the state and actually having snow is amazing. Cause I, I love to ski. So yeah. having snow is so, I love snow. I mean, yeah. I'm just a snow kid. I love snow. <laughs> um, Kevin James or Taylor Lautner. <laughs> I, I, okay. That, no, that's a curveball. I can't, <laughs> I can't do that. They're, they're both awesome. I'm not even, no. 
not, not, not allowed to answer that one. No, I'm just kidding. Yeah. I know. I'm probably both. <laughs> okay. Kevin is like my dad and Taylor's like my cool uncle. There we go. There you go. Cool uncle. I was there like brother, go. uncle. Like what's the <laughs> Instagram or TikTok? Instagram. I have a TikTok account. I don't really use it. So I do use my Instagram uh, a lot more, but yeah. I'd have to say Instagram. I just created a TikTok account a couple of weeks ago. I haven't really used it. Yeah. So Instagram. Yeah. Stay up late or get up early? Oh, you know what? I think like the ice cream or candy question, those are really- <laughs> go hand in hand. No, <laughs> I think I, uh, I do both. I, I can't always sleep. So I go to sleep at around 12 or one, which is normal for most yeah. people. But I don't think I've ever gotten up past like, well, not never, sorry. I normally <laughs> get up at around six to seven. So it's early kind of- bird gets the worm. Yep, exactly. There you go. Oh <laughs> and then aside from, so you're obviously you're young, you have a very, very big future ahead of you. What is one thing, do you have like a bucket list item you want to do in your career or your personal life? Like, what would you, like, if you did it, you'd be like, okay, I'm kind of set. <laughs> Ooh, you know, um, this may be in the far future. Uh, yeah. I'd love to write and direct one of my own films at some point. That's one yeah. thing that I've always wanted to do. If it's not, I mean, whether it's just one or many, that's something I want to do. Um, when I, when I get older and that's yeah. something I want to prepare myself for and hopefully do at some point. And once yeah. I do that, I think I'll be, I'll be set. <laughs> Would you give Teddy a role in the, in the movie? Hey, <laughs> You'd have to hey, audition. I might, I might. Yeah. You wouldn't have to audition, but yeah, sure. Why not? <laughs> I love it. Well, thank you so much. And congratulations on the home team. Thank you. Thank you, Jilly. <laughs>